Hi friends, welcome to the next video and in this particular video we will see how to enable the clustering feature. Okay, so now you can see the machines are being added to the domain and both machines uh, node 1 and node 2 are up and running. Okay, but we can see they are showing up in a local login and uh, to configure a cluster you must be in uh, logged in with uh, what you can say uh, domain admin okay so what we can do is we will go to other user and put the domain credentials now you can see it is signing in AI lab so I will put the domain credential here okay okay now you can see we are logged into the both boxes and uh, this is a node 1 and this is a node 2 okay so now we need to enable the failover clustering feature so for that we need to go to manage and select add rules and feature a dialog box will open I need to select next and we need to select role based and uh, feature based installation click next and uh, in this one uh, the IP address is 104 and with this one we will be enabling the feature okay so this is not a role and uh, this is sorry role and we need to select a feature and as the failover clustering feature is here okay so you can see failover clustering and we will add additional tools and click next and we will install okay so same thing which we need to do in the other node as well okay so we will go to manage and roles and features click next again next this is 103 that one is 104 and this is role we need to skip this and we need to select failover clustering add additional tools click next and install okay so this process will run and after this this machine will be having failover clustering installed okay in the first node it is completed we can click close okay and I will quickly check the other node as well that one is also completed we can click close here and here you can see some notification and it says that feature installation has been done okay and same thing I will check here as well okay it has been done okay so if we go to tools and I will see there should be there should be failover cluster okay I'm not able to relocate or yeah here is failover cluster manager I will click here and that should open after installing this particular feature okay so now I can see the failover cluster console is opened and let me check the same thing in this node as well tools and here failover cluster manager okay so the both servers is having now failover cluster feature is installed so see you in the next video and if you want to subscribe our full-fledged training the link is right below to check it out okay